So this is my Harvey Ambassador C14 bandsaw. Um, I re recently purchased this, I think I got it about six months ago or so, um, and it's turned out to be a pretty nice saw, but I still have the stock three quarter inch blade on it. I think this uh, saw is rated up to one inch blade that you can put on here, I think it's 125 inches. So um, the blade cuts pretty rough, um, but I haven't really been doing anything that requires anything other than uh, a rough blade. I've been rough cut, cutting some rough lumber down to size and things like that. Um, but I would like to start doing some veneers. And so I did purchase this Lennox blade here. Um, this Lennox is actually a uh, TriMaster. So this thing is carbide tipped, rated to cut through metal. So this should be really nice from what I've seen online. This should be really nice for cutting veneers and uh, just getting nice clean cuts. Uh, with the saw. So what I'm going to do is do some test cuts with the stock blade on here. The stock blade is still pretty sharp, so um, just a comparison between that stock blade and then what this new TriMaster can do. So as you can see from that quick test, um, this saw is definitely able to handle the TriMaster if you are looking to get that for this Ambassador saw. And also there is pretty much a day and night difference in the cut quality between the uh, stock saw blade that came with the uh, bandsaw and then also that Lennox TriMaster. So um, I think I can probably dial this in even better and get this even smoother, but just from a quick side-by-side uh, -side testing of the two, you can really see the difference in the two, especially if you're gonna be cutting some veneers or something like that. So hopefully this is helpful for anybody that has this saw or is looking at getting that Lennox TriMaster blade for their saw. Uh, leave some comments in the comments section. Thanks.